So, same thing, we have a division problem. Do you guys remember division? Instead of dividing something, we did what? Multiply by the reciprocal, right? So we gotta remember, we look at this and we say, well, what's the reciprocal of 3x squared minus 3x? One over that, right? Because remember, this can be written as a fraction, as that being the numerator and one being the denominator. So the reciprocal, we can write as x squared minus 5x plus 4 divided by 2x minus 8 times the reciprocal of 3x squared minus 3x. Now again, ladies and gentlemen, when you multiply, you just multiply across, right? But before, we always want to see what can we simplify with addition, or I'm sorry, by um, dividing out to 1. So again, what I'm simply going to do is write out each one of these factors. Actually, for this problem, let's just see if we can factor them. So can I factor out, I'm not going to write them in four quadrants like I did before. That's one way. You can also just say, all right, what's x squared minus 5x plus 4? Is that factorable? Yeah, we can rewrite that as x minus five, uh, 4 times x minus 1. Right? We can factor this, factor out a 2. And then here we can factor out a 3x, right? <coughs> yes? You guys kind of see how I just, re I just rewrote them. I transferred them into factored form. Now, let's write the factored form in. So I'll have x minus 4 times x minus 1 divided by 2 times x minus 4 times 3x times x minus 1. Well, when you write it in that format, because this would be times 1 and, and they just multiply it across. Remember guys, when you're multiplying, they all just come together. You're just multiplying all of them. All right? So now when you go and do this, you notice that x minus 4 divided by x minus 4, x minus 1 divided by x minus 1, those all go to 1, leaving you with 1 over 6x. <coughs> Anybody have any questions on that? Yes, no. Anybody want me to go back through a point? Um, yes. I'm kind of slow, so I lost you after the second one. <laughs> here to here? No. From there to the other one, yeah. Here to here. Well, yes, all I did, you see how I rewrote them as factors, right? Yeah. So I just put in their factored form down here. And you're multiplying them so they all come together, then they simplify to one. 